Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, as you guys can see, today's video is a hair video. Um, I'm trying to do a, a dry wash and go on my 4C hair. I do have 4C hair. It only looks like this right now because this is my stretched hair. How I stretch my hair is usually I just, as I wash it, I part it down the middle and do two braids, sleep, take it out, put it in two puff balls. But I have been doing twist outs lately, but to the, well, this weekend's twist out, it was done. Like, it's only Wednesday and my twist out is done. So, and I've been twisting my hair up at night. So, I decided, let me try and do a wet wash and go. I mean, a dry wash and go. Um, as you guys know, with 4C hair, water makes it shrink. That's why I have these clips right here. Cause as you can see it's shrunk up already but when i put it down you see my actual length this one part in the back it didn't shrink that much y'all can't see it but so what we're gonna do just spray that part oh i, I know i said dry wash and go y'all listen don't drag me i know i said dry wash and go but it literally makes no sense to put products in your hair with no only a little bit of water because i don't want it to shrink up too much Enough where I could get my comb through my head. Like that much. Then I'm taking sections. So I'm just going to take this section right here. And use my pink white tooth comb. It's not the whitest of teeth, but it's wide enough. And just detangle my hair very gently. So, I'm just going to section off my hair. So, I'm going to take this part right here. And I'm going to use one of these butterfly clips. To clip it away on my face. And since it has some water, just a little bit of water in it. I'm going to take the Aunt Jackie's Quench Leave-In Conditioner. Like this much per section. Just a small little dot. It's very moisturizing, y'all. And just finger the tingle also. And next, I'm going to take this Curls Creme Brulee Whipped Curl Cream. This will really give you the definition. Okay, like this much per section. Y'all can see that's the final. This just with two products. With this olive oil and grapeseed oil mixture. Just a little bit. I'm using the Aunt Jackie's Don't Shrink Gel. And I'm mixing that with the Eco Salad Gel. The olive oil one. Then with the Aunt Jackie's. And just coat my hair strands. And get the roots also. And after Aunt Jackie's, I go in with the Eco, just small amounts. Get the roots also. Finger to tingle it. And then I do the shingling method. So I just take a piece of hair and twirl it around my finger all the way until I get to the end. And let it fall. So it curls back up. If this turn out good, I'm gonna be so happy. Repeating this, in, in case y'all don't know, this is stretch for C hair. If I really wet my hair, like if I added way more water than that, I'll be shrunken again. And shrinkage is a good sign because that I means your hair is healthy. However, it makes you look bald head. Clip, any kind of clip, I'm just using these cute hair clips. And clip it. So that's what I'm doing all over my head. I can't really show y'all all over my head. But hopefully y'all can see the definition in these ones. So I just finished twisting everything. I'm not doing no 
these ones. I feel like I might be making a mistake by not doing these ones. But the back of my head. Just finished at 6.43 and I started at 5.54. So I don't know how long that was, but almost an hour. So as you guys can see, today's the next day. Um I did the banding method last night. And I also did the top part of my head. So let's take out the bands. My hair feel it don't feel super hard. Like you can barely tell because of the oil I put, but So, I didn't film my outro to this video. Um, I really did like the way my hair turned out. The only thing was, it, it was kind of stringy. Not gonna lie, it was kind of stringy. I should have picked it out more. And I should have stretched it. That was before I started stretching it out after I do the finger curl. But, this is just some critique. Um, I really like, I really, I really think everybody with 4 hair should at least give it a try. At least, obviously, the products don't work for you just try some different ones that might work but yeah i really like the way it turned out it really defined my curl so if you really want your curls defined just do that but if you don't then just don't it's not too much work though just put, put on your favorite tv show while you're doing it and time will fly and next thing you know you're done all you gotta do is figure out how you're gonna wrap it up when you see also one thing i forgot to say when i wrapped it up before i set I told you I did the banding method and I still had the clips in. I'd use, I have a scarf on right now, but I use a scarf, put it over top of my head so everything lay down flat. So in the morning, while I took it out, it'll be, it'll be nice. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like it, please leave it a thumbs up, subscribe down below for more, just like it. I'm having a lot of hair videos about my natural hair because I'm trying to figure out how am I going to do this. But I think this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm doing, period. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Check out my latest video. It will be next. And next, I did this clip. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>